And certainly that does have an impact in a sense that many youth uh, are able to identify with you and they listen to your, you know, your lectures and uh, they draw inspiration. Uh, when we talk about drawing youth towards the Dean of Islam and uh, you know, providing them with content and things that will inspire them, what is, how do we attract them and how do we appeal to them? How honest do you want me to be? As honest as uh, you know, what is in your heart, you say it as it is. Okay, well, I believe that we do a lot of injustice towards the youth. And the truth is, I feel like we contradict ourselves so much. Because we display one thing, but in reality, we want another. So we say we want the youth, we want the youth, and everything you do online, I mean, wherever I go, organizations, big organizations, uh, media outlets, whatever it is, they always display that we do what we do because we want the youth. Yet when the youth come to us, we question them, we doubt them, we don't give them roles, we don't give them any positions, right? So it's like we say one thing, but we actually do another. The youth, the Prophet of Allah, he says, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Nusirtu Bishabab, he says, I was given victory to the youth. He loved the youth, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. The youth is where the heart is, it's where the passion is, it's where the enthusiasm is. Now, of course, we don't take away anything from our elders and our seniors and our ulama, you know, we pray for them and we need their watchful eye but the youth i feel that a lot of the youth have turned away because it's like you know i have no role like i'll give you an example we get a young man who comes on to dean and it's the nature i know it's difficult but it's the reality when someone comes on to dean especially if he has jahiliya he comes enthusiastic he's hungry he wants dean and he wants it all right now now good or bad i know we can debate this i understand but what do you do with this enthusiasm? There's no role for him. There's nowhere to go. You look at our institutions, you look at our organizations, the same mullah, the same elder that's been there for the last 50 years, he won't give up his seat. And even if he does, it's probably to his son or to his grandson or to his nephew. So what are we doing? We say we want the youth, but then we've got no role for them, do we?